Hey, it's me, uh, Stephen Kramer Glickman from the uh, TV show Big Time Rush on Nickelodeon. Uh, welcome to my Twitter answering feed where I uh, answer questions from my Twitter fans. Uh, I'm gonna answer Dude, some what are you questions. doing? I'm, I'm Stephen Glickman. I'm answering. I'm Stephen Glickman. Why are you doing that? Why, why are you claiming you're Stephen Glickman? I'm Stephen Glickman. Because I'm Stephen, I'm Stephen Glickman. You're Adam. But I'm Stephen Glickman. Dude, don't ever do that again. Okay, Stephen Hi, I'm Stephen Kramer Glickman. Welcome to my answer, where I answer, I answer all the questions on Twitter. Here we go. We start here with, um, oh gosh, uh, XX Danny underscore Jonas XX says, Stephen Glickman, how does the milk stay cold when it's inside the cow? Guess what? I know this. A post popular belief cows are put, they, they live inside of refrigerators right before they get milked. You don't think that's how it works? You're wrong. That's what they do. They stick them inside of a giant fridge and all their head sticks out and they get to watch episodes of the Golden Girls and then their body gets all cold but it's like that good kind of cold and then they just start on, start milking. That's the truth. Okay, here we go. If there was a, a, a sneaker bite says, if there was a huge, ferocious chocolate tiger in front of you, what would you do? Easy. Eat it. I know that you, that's what you were expecting. But any large animal made of chocolate, whether it's a bunny or it's an elephant, I'm gonna, I'm just going to eat the whole thing because I love chocolate. Adam, did I, have, did I eat chocolate tonight? You, you had a, a chocolate alpaca for dinner. That's right. I had a chocolate alpaca for dinner. If you don't know what that is, look it up on Wikipedia's. On, on Wikipedia's. Okay. If I could be any Pokemon character, which one would I be? That's from RJR4 underscore Lova Hender. Yeah, I'm a grown up. So I don't, uh. I don't, I don't watch Pokemon. So I wouldn't know that. Yeah, I have no idea. Sorry, can't help. Pikachu! Pika Pika! That's creepy, but. That's a little creepy, I apologize. What do you like to eat? Says Psy Penna XX. Um, what do I like to eat? Pizza, Chinese food, and rainbows. So and poquito um, moss. And poquito moss, which is a Mexican food place here in Los Angeles. And I get burritos. I get burritos when I go there with a little salsa fresca. Maybe a carne asada burrito. Chrissy Explosion asked me, oh, "What's my favorite Harry Potter book, movie, and character?" Um, I like the Prisoner of Ak. Ah, as, 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 uh, thank you, Adam. The Prisoner of As, as, as Cap. Azkaban. 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 That sounds weird. Like as Caban. No, like as A Z. Oh, as Caban. That makes a lot more sense. It does. Yeah. Um, I also think that I would have been perfect to play that giant guy with the beard. Giant guy with the beard. Yeah, what's that guy's name? Hagrid. I'd make a really great Hagrid. So, maybe in the musical Harry Potter, I'll get to play Hagrid. Are they really going to do it? I if don't think so, but if they did, I they would do should. Who? Um, does your throat ever hurt? Do you ever lose your voice after hours of yelling at Gustavo? That says Malibu X. Yes, it, I have. I've lost my voice and gotten laryngitis four times playing Gustavo, but I've learned how to yell properly and how to support from my diaphragm. And so, uh, being a professional actor, you learn these things so that you don't continue losing your voice. And that was a lesson in things with Stephen Glick. Okay, we're going to keep going. What came first, chicken or the egg? Uh, Jocelyn Schmidt wrote that. 
Uh, I think they actually finally figured out it was the chicken. It was the chicken first? Yeah. There was like a it's funny because I always thought it was the egg. No, it was the chicken that came first. You know, I read an article that it was the egg. Really? Almost positive. I think we're going to have to Google that later. We're going to have to Google it we'll later. We'll get back to you on that. Let's see. Um, all right. Angie81095 wrote, 13 minutes ago, she wrote this. Does anyone notice Stephen Glickman tells us to ask him questions and he still hasn't answered one? LOL. That's because I'm doing it on YouTube. Okay? That's how I roll. I do it on YouTube. So just relax. Okay? Relax. I love you. Relax. Okay. Do you like ghost adventures? No, I don't. Not really. Because they're always the same. They're always... <laughs> there's always that moment where they're like... Like this. Here's my, uh, here's my impression. Like three times. This is my impression of, of a ghost adventure show. Are you ready? Hang on. We'll do it. I'll do it with Adam. Adam, come into the picture. Adam, we were tracking the noises here on the uh, scanner. Yeah. That, oh my God. Did you hear that? Did you hear what that? Did you hear that sound? It sounded like. It sounded like. Sound. Oh, wait, wait. Play it again. Play it again. We have. We can replay it. We can replay. Let's, it. let's replay it. Let's replay it three times. Three times in a row. Oh my God! He was asking if I missed my grandmother. That's amazing. How does it know that your grandmother? I have no idea. That's why I can't watch those shows. All right, let's see what else we got. All right. We just got a couple more, and then we're we're all done here. How often do the big time Rush boys mess up on set? That is private information, and I cannot tell you that they never mess up on set, ever. Uh, how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? That is from Brianna Joy. No duh. Um, uh, fourteen pounds. No duh. No, no duh. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, Parafreak asked me, can I tell Kendall that uh, you say hi? And uh, no, I can't. Actually, you know what? Let's just do it. Hang on a second. I mean, it's 1 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and he has to work tomorrow, but... Let's see real quick. <laughs> Parafreak, I'm telling him it's you. It's not me. It's ringing. Kendall. Kendall, wake up. Kendall, it, there's something very important I need to talk to you about. Kendall, it's an emergency. I'm, no, I'm serious. Kendall. No, tell your mom to go back to sleep. You and me can handle this ourselves. All right. There's no need to turn to freak out. This is very important. I'm on Twitter right now, and I uh, I told everybody to ask me questions. And this girl, she said, uh, "Oh my God." <laughs> she said to ask you. She said to say hi. You know. And her name is Paraf Parafreak. She said to say hi. And it's what you know what. And I just wanted to just. I just wanted to wish her, just, just make it happen for her, you know? Because who knows when she's going to get get to say hi to you, you know? Like, who knows when that's going to happen? You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Kendall? Kendall? Um, oh, no. I called Logan. You called. Yikes! Ouch. Well, that concludes doing my uh, qu the questions for the evening of October. This is October sixth, Wednesday. I still consider it Tuesday, but you guys do whatever you want. Th guys, thank you for all the fun questions and have a good night. Peace.